Brantley Gilbert, uh, what is up? Have you been here before to Sarnia or Bayfest or any of this stuff? I uh, sure hadn't. It's my first time. Yeah? We're excited about it. Man. How do you like it so far? It's going great. I hadn't I hadn't got a chance to see anything quite yet. You know, yeah. we pulled in, went across the border this morning, and I slept late, so yeah. They didn't get me off the bus to check my passport or nothing, so oh, good. <laughs> it was it was good. It was good. Oh, it's a great festival. You'll love it. It's an awesome time. And uh, I know that uh, some people know this, but not everyone does. But I and you're probably sick of people asking you about it. But uh, the Jason Aldean songs, Dirt Road Anthem, and My Kind of Party. Uh, Jason is pretty famous for those songs. But those are actually a couple songs from your first album, and you got some help from Colt Ford on uh, Dirt Road Anthem as well. So there was a lot of gossip when this all first happened about you selling out or whatever people wanted to call it. But uh, what exactly happened there? Let everyone know uh, your opinion on that situation. You know, we released a video and that whole spat was going on a lot of people thought i'd you know sold the songs or whatever that's not the case they're still my babies we still play them every night and you know the people i wrote those songs for and about uh, they have them on both records you know prodigal son had my kind of party on it and i wrote that song when i was 17 you yeah. know i've been playing it for years and uh dirt road anthem really you know i felt like you and we discussed you know releasing that as a single and you know what we come up with is you know, it, it was a very controversial song, and I didn't know if, if we were at a point, you know, they were still calling us a new artist, you know. We've yeah. been around for 12 years and kicking this thing for 12 years, but uh, I guess as far as radio and corporate things are concerned, we're still new. So I didn't know if we quite had the ability to take it, you know, to push push a controversial song like that through. And Jason confronted us about uh, about doing that, and we felt like he was in a, a more more able position to do that so i think it worked out good for all of us and i mean we still play them songs every night we'll be playing them tonight awesome and uh he even brought jason even brought like ludicrous into the song too at one point eh? like that's oh, just yeah. like, so different i thought that was pretty cool yeah. i got a co-write with ludicrous all right yeah. indirectly <laughs> All right, and uh, another awesome song of yours, Country Must Be Countrywide, and we heard it during uh, sound check. You sound amazing, and uh, it, it's such an awesome, it's a well-written song, and all of your songs are. It's just, it proves how well of a songwriter you are. So how does the writing process work for you? You know, it could be, it, it, there's so many different ways, you know. It, you could get an idea of riding down the road in your car, and, you know, I'm on my cell phone all the time, you know, writing down notes or something if I come up with an idea, but... You know, a lot of times I write by myself. A lot of times I write with other folks. You know, it just all depends on the situation. Mm -hmm. And uh, we've talked about a few of your songs now. Do you have a favorite one to uh, perform live? Definitely. Kick It In The Sticks is, yeah. is my favorite one to do live. It's actually, I, I can let you in on a little secret. It's going to be our next single. So Awesome. And uh, you have opened for a lot of country, uh, great country artists like Eric Church and Toby Keith tonight and on this tour. So at the end of September, though, you're starting your very first headlining tour. How does that feel? It feels amazing. Yeah. Man. We're, we're so excited we can't hardly see straight, but it'll be great. Yeah, we're really excited. So uh, everyone's so excited to see you perform tonight. The sound check sounded amazing. I know everyone couldn't be here to hear it, but we were here sitting all day <laughs> listening, and it sounded awesome. So best of luck, and we can't wait to see you tonight. Uh, well, thank you very much for having me. I appreciate it.